Hi, this is Dow Too Fast here. In this video, I will show you this brand new LED light from this company. I believe it's called OED Row, and this one is the X3 series. This X3 series puts out 6,000 lumens, and it uses the Philips ZES chip technology. The color temperature of this light is 6,500 Kelvin, which is a white light. Now, it also comes with two additional color filter films. If you put the yellow film on, it will change it to a 3000 Kelvin, an amber color. Or if you install the blue filter film, then it will output 8000 Kelvin, which is a cool bluish light. So let me go ahead and open this up and I'll show you what this light looks like. Here we have the colored films. Product manual. Here's the LED light. Right out of the box, the first thing I notice is the design of this light is beautiful. It's just a cool looking light. The overall construction is all metal. We have a glass lens right here. The heat sink at the bottom is black. Now you'll notice it does not use an external LED driver. The LED driver is integrated inside the light right here. And according to the manufacturer, it has an intelligent dynamic IC driver and it also senses whether the car is static or is moving so it can adjust the brightness if it needs to. And because it uses an intelligent driver you'll notice this light does not require the use of a mechanical fan for cooling. The heat sink at the base has high thermal conductivity which allows for very efficient heat dissipation. Altogether it allows for this very compact and sleek design. This light is IP67 rated so it's waterproof. Now another nice feature they've integrated into this light is if you look at this hole right here they've included the allen wrench for you to loosen the set screw in here. When you loosen this you can actually rotate the base for the socket here and this will allow you to adjust the beam pattern to match that of your halogen lights. On the wiring there's a tag here that tells you this light will operate between 9 volt to 32 volt. Also, it outputs 6,000 lumens. Now, the color filters that come with these lights are stickers. So, you can peel these off and stick it onto the glass surface right here. For my application, I will leave it clear. So, I'll get 6,500 Kelvin, which is a pure white. So, let me connect my power supply to one of these lights, and I'll show you what the light output looks like. I'll be installing these lights in the fog lights of this 2017 Nissan Pathfinder. The one that came from the factory are halogen bulbs. And let me turn them on so you can see what it looks like. Replacing the bulb on this vehicle is very easy. Right now we're looking at the driver's side. This is the headlight. And if you look below that, That bulb with the blue marking at the back, that is the fog light. So you can reach down there, remove that bulb, and install the LED lights. Here's the halogen bulb. Now we'll install the LED lights. Here you see the LED light installed. Over here is the connector that connects to the factory harness. And here's a look at the LED light installed without turning it on. So let me give you a comparison look between the LED light on the driver's side and the halogen bulb on the passenger side. Now I know the camera is showing the LED light with a blue tinge but looking at it right now it's pure white. There is no blue tinge to it. To install the light on the passenger side there is less room to put your hand through but it can be done. You want to reach underneath, right behind that opening that you see right there. You'll get access to the fog light bulb. Here's a look with both sides installed.
And here's a look from inside the vehicle. Let me turn on the fog light now. Off. On. Well, I hope you enjoy watching the review of this OED Row X3 LED lights. As you can see, it has a very nice and sleek design. I really like the fact that you can adjust the base if you want to. Also, the color output and the brightness is really good. Now, this X3 series light come in many different bulb sizes. So if you want to find something that will fit your vehicle, I recommend you check out their website. I'll put the link for this light in the description below. If you have any questions or comments, leave one in the comment section. And don't forget to click on a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.